In today's Midday Fix, a Cubs song rarely heard before will get some renewed life tomorrow night. The tune, Come Out to Wrigley Field, was written by a World War II vet and City of Chicago employee, P.J. Panico, who passed away at age 95 a few years ago. A recording of that song was discovered by his grandson, Rob Sorwork, who then passed it along to a longtime family friend and musician, Chicago's own Sam Fazio. In just a few moments, Sam will give us a sneak peek ahead of tomorrow's performance at Gallagher Way Outside the Friendly Confines. We welcome you both and your band as well. What a great story. So I want to start with you. A couple of years ago, you're going through some old stuff of your grandfather's and you come upon this. That's right. Uh, it was uh, an old 78 RPM record and it just said uh, Cub song or something like that and written in pen and I noted it and then I didn't think about it for a while until after he passed away and then we finally played it and I realized what it was wow. and I shared it with my whole family and then we all realized what, how great it was. Because my understanding, it wasn't commercially produced, right? That's so it's right. something him and a couple of his buddies got together, recorded and said, hey, this is pretty cool and then put it aside. That's right. He and his friend and collaborator Paul Gallus, they worked on the song together. Uh, it was a demo, so it said Cub Song Demo, and uh, I just don't think that they found an opportunity to use it, so they put it in, he, my grandpa put it in a pile of his stuff. So it must make you feel so great, so proud to honor your grandfather this way. Yeah, absolutely. I feel really proud. You got a little butterflies in your stomach looking ahead to tomorrow? Not really, because I trust Sam, and I'm so glad that, that he's able to sing the song and, and be our champion. So. so set this up. Sam is a family friend, right? That's right. So when you had this opportunity, you must have been like, oh my God, this seemingly comes out of left field, so to speak, and you embraced it completely. Um, how true are you to the original? And then I'm sure you kind of lent your own artistic creativity to it, right? Yeah, I'm pretty true to the original. So I wanted to do it as a jazz combo, but no accordion. So uh, piano. <laughs> PJ, yeah. Grandpa, right? Yeah, on the accordion. piano, drums, and bass, uh, uh, you know, a, a nice jazz trio. And we're very true to the original Good. Original arrangement. Well, the weather looks great for tomorrow. Please introduce your bandmates, if you will, before we get into this. Sir, I have Kevin Fort here. Hi, Kevin. And Luke Sagaman. Luke. And uh, Mike. Benning. So thank you guys so much. If you would please take it away. You want me to hold that? I'm going to put it down right here. Okay. okay? All right. Thank you all for being here. Come out to Wrigley Field, the home of the Cubs. The cares will fly right over the wall. Strike out your troubles and woes when you let yourself go. See the National League play ball. Now you'll get some real action. You'll be right in it. The sun will relax you. Enjoy every minute down at Wrigley Field. The home of the cops. Come and pitch your worries away. Wrigley Field, the home of the Cubs, your cares will fly right over the wall. Strike out your troubles and woes when you let yourself go and see the National League play ball. Now you'll get some real action, you'll be right in it. The sun will relax you, enjoy every minute down at Wrigley Field. The home of the Cubs, come and strike your worries away. Lots of fun for your money way out in the sun. You'll have a picnic at beautiful Wrigley Field. 